the education system is f And I know what you're thinking. Hey, 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 Mr. Tosier, what are you talking about? <laughs> Just let me explain. So firstly, we have an education system that is largely based on memorization and regurgitation of information. <laughs> we are expected to sit in a classroom for hours on end, memorize information that we may never use again in our lives, and then regurgitate it regurgitate it that you um you had you 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 could you do you you want you you could do so you you do you could you you want on a test this doesn't encourage any creativity or critical thinking and it's not an effective way to learn secondly uh, the education system is failing to prepare students for the, the real world we have a system that values test scores uh, or grades over actual real-life skills. Students are not taught to think critically, uh, solve problems, or communicate effectively. Something else is bothering me. Last week, nobody helped Obama in the voting. Like, there's no black senators. No black senators. Instead, they are taught to follow rules and obey. This is not preparing them for the real challenges that they will face in the real world. Finally, the education system is failing to keep up with the rapid changes in technology and the job market. We have an education system that was designed for a whole different era. <coughs> and it's not equipped to prepare us uh, for the jobs of the future. So, what's the solution? I don't think we can change the entire education system, but what we can do is to educate ourselves online. And I guess that's it for this video. Thanks for watching. And before I leave, remember, it's gay not to subscribe. Ah!